Tristan has made horrible decisions and choices, you know, with my sister. He gets me too, like they make it look like the girl is like a loser or unable to not be cheated on. Or because I don't want this behavior to be something that I'm validating or I'm justifying. Knowing that the goal was like not about who's right or wrong, just like moving past it. And so what's going on with you and Chloe? I mean, you know, some days are good and some days, you know, she gets a little frustrated about. Brush it off and are fine. And then I was just like so triggered and I was like, I just can't do it anymore. Like, this is not something that can be undone. But if he's in this pattern, why does she have to just keep suffering? Courtney's Candid Confession. Kourtney Kardashian has candidly shared her feelings about Tristan Thompson, the ex-partner of her sister Khloe Kardashian, during an episode of Hulu's The Kardashians. The reality star, aged 44, expressed that both she and her 11-year-old daughter Penelope harbor negative sentiments towards the NBA player. Kourtney revealed that on the first day of school, she found herself deeply affected by Thompson's presence. While she acknowledged the reasons behind her reaction, she emphasized how everyone tends to downplay such situations, but she couldn't simply overlook it any longer. In a confessional segment, Courtney, who co-parents Penelope with her ex-partner Scott Disick, provided further insight. She addressed Tristan Thompson's past behavior, referencing the detrimental decisions and choices he has made, particularly in relation to her sister Chloe. The lack of honesty is what does it for me, is like, let's just be honest. Tristan has made horrible decisions and choices, you know, with my sister. With who we are and what we're doing and the mistakes we're making because it's way less hurtful. There's times when I'm so triggered by him, I can't be around him. Brush it off and are fine. And then I was just like so triggered and I was like, I just can't do it anymore. Like. Tristan Thompson has been at the center of various controversies involving infidelity, which has understandably strained his relationships within the Kardashian family. Courtney's candid confession sheds light on the emotional toll such incidents have taken on her and her daughter. The acknowledgement of her feelings is a significant step in recognizing and processing the impact of Tristan's actions on their family dynamics. It reflects Courtney's commitment to her own well-being and that of her daughter, prioritizing their emotional health above all else. This candid revelation also highlights the complexities of co-parenting within a high-profile family and the challenges that can arise when personal feelings intersect with shared familial responsibilities. Courtney's willingness to share her struggles on a public platform is a testament to her authenticity and the importance of open dialogue surrounding sensitive topics. Ultimately, Courtney's confession serves as a reminder of the resilience and strength required to navigate complex relationships, especially within a spotlighted family like the Kardashians. It reinforces the significance of setting boundaries and prioritizing one's emotional well-being even in the face of challenging circumstances. Kardashians Navigate Complex Emotions In a recent episode of Hulu's The Kardashians, Courtney Kardashian opened up about her feelings towards Tristan Thompson, NBA player and ex-partner of her sister Chloe. Courtney revealed that she experienced intense emotional reactions, describing herself as triggered by Tristan, particularly when it comes to her 11-year-old daughter Penelope. In a candid revelation, she mentioned that on the first day of school, she experienced a strong emotional reaction to him. She expressed understanding of the underlying reasons for her feelings, despite the tendency to downplay such emotions and maintain composure. She reached a point where she couldn't continue in the same manner. He gets me too, like they make it look like the girl is like a loser or unable to not be cheated on. Or They've given Tristan so many opportunities and chances to work on himself. With my kids that coming from a more loving approach works best. Nothing really, ha like we didn't have a talk, like nothing even really happened. And treat my sister the way that she deserves to be treated. Courtney, who has a history with Tristan due to his involvement with her sister, emphasized the complexity of her emotions. She grapples with wanting harmony for the family, acknowledging Tristan as the father of her niece and nephew while simultaneously struggling with her own discomfort. Khloe Kardashian, Tristan's ex and the mother of his two children, True and Tatum, also shared her perspective. 
she expressed pride in her own progress in co-parenting with Tristan, emphasizing that her evolving relationship with him is separate from what she expects from her family members. Where I am at with Tristan has nothing to do with what I expect my family members to do. If this is not something that can be undone, but if he's in this pattern, why does she have to just keep suffering? Penelope has her feelings about Tristan, rightfully so. I'm good for you, girl. And then there's times when I just let it go because we just want harmony. Because I don't want this behavior to be something that I'm validating or I'm justifying. You know, he's the father of my niece and nephew. Chloe affirmed her support for Penelope's feelings, recognizing the importance of validating her emotions. She expressed that she hoped Penelope would be allowed to experience her emotions without interference. She emphasized the importance of not inadvertently validating or justifying certain behavior. According to her, it was crucial for Penelope to understand that her feelings were valid and should be acknowledged. In a previous episode, Kim Kardashian provided her own viewpoint on Tristan's role in the family dynamic. She acknowledged his positive attributes as a friend and father but also acknowledged his past infidelity struggles. Kim's perspective reflects a nuanced approach, recognizing the complexities of human relationships. While Tristan has made significant mistakes in the past, the family appears to be navigating the situation with a balanced understanding, taking into account both his positive contributions and past shortcomings. Overall, the Kardashian family's approach towards Tristan Thompson illustrates a multi-layered understanding of relationships, forgiveness, and the importance of validating each other's feelings, especially those of the younger family members like Penelope. This candid discussion sheds light on the complexities that arise when dealing with past hurts and the path towards healing and reconciliation. Kim Kardashian's Intricate Perspective Kim Kardashian's perspective on Tristan Thompson is a complex mix of acknowledging his past wrongs while also recognizing his efforts to be a better person, particularly as a father figure to her nieces and nephews. She begins by acknowledging that there are times when she's deeply affected by his actions. It's natural to feel anger and resentment towards someone who has hurt a loved one. Tristan's past behavior has been deeply problematic, and these issues have caused heated discussions among the family. However, Kim also believes in acknowledging the positive aspects of Tristan. She appreciates the moments when he has demonstrated kindness, decency, and friendship. He's taken steps to be present for Kim's children, especially in situations where she's needed support. His involvement in their lives has been significant. He attends their games, spends times with them, and takes them out for meals. When Kim faces challenges or conflicts, Tristan is there to offer his support. This includes situations involving Kim's ex-husband Kanye West, Kim values these actions and sees them as indications of his potential for growth and change. In essence, Kim's stance is rooted in the belief that people are capable of evolving and becoming better versions of themselves. She refuses to completely write someone off, recognizing that individuals have the capacity for growth. Her approach reflects a nuanced understanding of human behavior and the potential for redemption. However, Khloe Kardashian, Tristan's ex-partner, offers a contrasting viewpoint. She believes that it's crucial to acknowledge and validate the feelings of those who have been wronged. Chloe emphasizes that it's essential not to accept mistreatment and to recognize when boundaries have been crossed. That how she's feeling is the right way to feel. We should not accept someone treating us like this. Knowing that the goal was like not about who's right or wrong, just like moving past it. And I think everyone has to handle their co-parenting situation in their own style. Don't want to have a deep talk about it. We just want to move on. Just sweep it under the rug. <laughs> just move on. Penelope to have these feelings and I don't want to talk her out of them. Chloe's perspective is an important counterbalance to Kim's. It highlights the significance of prioritizing one's own well-being and not tolerating behavior that is harmful or disrespectful. Ultimately, the Kardashian sisters navigate complex emotions when it comes to Tristan Thompson. Their varying viewpoints reflect the intricate nature of human relationships, especially those involving forgiveness, growth, and setting boundaries. The sisters' discussion and reflections on Tristan's role within the family provide a glimpse into the complexities of their personal lives and the decisions they make in pursuit of healthy relationships. Kim's Hope for Positive Change 
Kim Kardashian's perspective on Tristan Thompson reflects a nuanced understanding of human behavior and growth. Despite acknowledging the gravity of Thompson's past actions and the pain he caused, Kim chooses to recognize his potential for positive change. Kim's acknowledgement of Thompson's positive qualities, such as being a good friend and father figure, highlights her belief in his ability to evolve. She appreciates the moments where he stepped up to support her and her children during challenging times, demonstrating a sense of responsibility and care. Kim's refusal to throw him away indicates her commitment to seeing beyond his past mistakes. She understands that people are capable of transformation and believes in giving them the opportunity to grow. This perspective aligns with a belief in second chances and the potential for redemption. Her support for Thompson in his role as a father to her nieces and nephews emphasizes the importance of family unity and co-parenting. By recognizing and appreciating his efforts, Kim encourages a healthy co-parenting dynamic that benefits the children involved. In Kim's view, forgiveness and growth are not mutually exclusive from holding individuals accountable for their actions. But it's such a lack of respect. This is somebody who's got a pattern of bad behavior. So what's going on with you and Chloe? Yeah, I mean, you know, some days are good and some days, you know, she gets a little frustrated about what, I don't even you know. think it's to her anymore about, like, getting over the past, like, things that you guys have been through. To say the truth and to, like, find out on the internet and not feel like you're in the loop. She's always, like, the tough Chloe that doesn't give a mm -hmm. Like, you're never going to get to the finish line if you're trying to always please the masses. Somebody that has lied to her since June. She acknowledges the severity of Thompson's past behavior while also valuing the progress he has made. Overall, Kim's perspective reflects a balanced approach to relationships, recognizing both the flaws and potential for positive change in individuals. Her willingness to see beyond past wrongs and offer support in moments of struggle demonstrates a belief in the capacity for growth and redemption. That's all for this video, folks. We'll see you next time.